it's sad to announce that this truck is being sold and there's three main reasons to it. Hi, welcome back to carsaddiction.com. I'm Ryan and welcome to the channel. We usually share a video every Wednesday and Sunday, but this week's a bit special. We're sharing Toyota Hilux content every day. Now, this truck is being sold and there's three main reasons to it. Well, it's a really sad announcement that I'm selling this truck, but bear with me, I have valid reasons for it. Um, it's against my heart, but the first reason is that storage. So as you all know, I like to keep my cars in garages. Um, it's more safe against theft. If I'm modifying uh, something on the truck, I can finish it the day after and leave it you know, open and exposed. Um, the weather, the weathering won't happen. As you can see, there is dew on the truck and the sun is actually scorching. Well, it's still eight o'clock in the morning, but later on it will be scorching. So evaporating on the paintwork, making it more dull. I know there is treatment, you can do it and all that, but that's a lot of things to take care of when you have a lot of cars in the garage. So basically you would want a garage. Now we did find a garage off site, but what was happening is that the the truck used to do some amounts of time, I mean weeks, not being used just because of laziness, because the garage is not with the house. So one issue is space. I did not have the space for this. This truck takes about almost a car and a half space in my garage. And that's why I couldn't do it in the main garage and I had to do it off site. So selling this will actually free me some money on garage rent. Second reason is I did not anticipate that the truck would need it so much things to do. So I'm already 1000 euros in. I am nowhere finished. I, um, I still might have to buy new tires to fit the mud flaps properly. I needed to get the roll bar fitted. That is a lot of engineering work. Uh, the interior needs a lot of plastics re replaced. Um, I still need to buy the chrome mirrors, the chrome bumper. It's keep on adding. Now that won't be an issue if you have a car. This is your main car or you only have, this is one of two cars. But it comes an issue when you have more than five cars in my situation. And that spending money on this means I have to spend less money on the other cars, which does not make sense. I thought this truck was complete and did not need that much little things. Or it's just me being picky and making it what I wanted. So I did not really anticipate that I'm going to be spending a lot of money on this. So I said better sell it off and cut my losses right now before I go into it further and get it out of control. Reason number three, we are actually selling three cars, this one and another two, the Abarth and Celica. I decided to downside my fleet and buy one epic car. I will release what I'll be buying later in the year, so if you're not subscribed, make sure you do so and hit that notification button below to be the first to know when I announce the news. So with the summer coming and temperatures reaching to 40 degrees Celsius in Malta, I wasn't really looking forward working on the truck outside and getting drenched in sweat. I know in the future if I want to get back into one, I can find another one. These trucks are very common here, well, not the extra cab, but I'm sure next time with my newfound experience, I'll know what to look out for and buy something more complete. Now, how much I sold the truck for, I'm not going to disclose exactly, but I can rest assured they're cheaper than these Porsche magnesium rims that I've been eyeing for, but they're really out of my budget. I want to stick to buying that epic car and saving all I can to buy this car. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. Take care.